Hey, we're the Ohio Guys on location at Anime Boston in Boston, Massachusetts. And today we're joined by Zach Bolton. How are you doing today? I'm doing great. How are you? Good. Uh, what is it like working in the industry today? Uh, it's great. It's uh, This job has been amazing to me. It's I really couldn't ask for anything more. It's, it's a lot of fun. Uh, you know, day in, day out, I get to record voices and, you know, bring these characters to life in, in the English language, so I, it's great. Good. Um, what is the favorite anime that you worked on, if you can pick one? A lot of people like say, <laughs> a lot of people like trying to pick your favorite baby or something like it's, that. It's a little bit like that. Uh, I probably have a top four or five, kind of Shin-Chan, Dark in the Black, Soul Eater, Trigun, a few others, but yeah, those are probably at the top of the pile. Probably Shin-Chan, if, if I had to pick one. We'll, yeah. move, we'll move the questions around then. What was sure. it like working on Shin Chan? Shin, uh, working on Shin Chan was great. Um, that one in particular too, because we got to, we did change the scripts, which normally doesn't happen. Usually, it's a, a very literal, straight adaptation of the Japanese to English. Uh, but with Shin Chan, since we were going for the uh, for a different audience and kind of reworking the show a little bit more, there was a lot more creativity on our part to come up with the scripts, come up with the jokes, a lot more ad-libbing in the booth while we were recording. Um, so the creativity and kind of forming the characters in that show, it was it was more of our own thing, um, kind of taking what was already there in Japan and then adding our own extra twist to it. So it was a lot of fun. Okay. Um, what was it like working on Soul Eater? Soul Eater, also one of, <laughs> one of my favorite shows, too. Um, it was great having a full 50 plus episodes to, to work with Micah and Laura and the, the entire cast. Um, it's such a, a well done show. The, everything from the plot to the, the character design, the backgrounds, everything is so well done on it that it was, it was a real pleasure to work on. If you could be any character you played in real life, who would it be? And you can mix and match if you want to. <laughs> uh, that's a tough question. I'm gonna go with Action Bastard um, because he's a bastard, and he's got all the cool Batman toys, but more bastardly. And he's got a cool mask. Okay. <laughs> um, is there anything coming out that you can talk about right now, or is there something that might have recently just come out that you want to plug? Uh, well, our our big thing this weekend here at Anime Boston is Aoreka Seven AO. Um, we're gonna be premiering that. Uh, so yeah, that's that's the one to, to check out. Uh, Soul Eaters on Adult Swim right now, so definitely check that out also. And, yeah. Okay, uh, do you have any uh, Facebook pages, Twitter, anything else for the fans to reach you in social media? Yeah, I do have a, a public Facebook page. Uh, it's Zach Bolton Director, uh, so you can probably search and find that. Currently, it's got a big Soul Leader logo as the main picture, so look for that. Okay. We've been the Ohio Guys on location. I'm Mike, and he's Zach, and we'll see you next time.